Wow. I saw these and said immediately yes. <laughs> Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Raven and I'm a fashion stylist and content creator. But on my channel, I do press on nail reviews and hauls, honey, fashion hauls, a little bit of DH Gate, and some travel. So in this video, honey, okay, we're going back to the AliExpresses and getting some nails. I stayed away from like the dollar, two dollar nails this time, okay? We went a little bit higher price point to four dollars, okay? Not much, but we went there. And I'm so glad that I did. These are cute, y'all. Per usual, everything will be linked in the description box below. So let's just get into this haul. First up, let's talk about the nails that I'm wearing. This is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the 24 piece cat eye false nail and they were $4.38. When I tell you that I am obsessed with these nails, oh my gosh, they're so gorgeous. I literally was taking everything out of the packs, you know, what they were shipped in. And I was like, what nails are we going to wear for the video? I saw these and said, immediately yes. Immediately yes. Now I will say, because they about like $4, honey, some of these butterflies had already came off and we had to pop them back on. It's that like jelly gummy kind of like adhesive that really don't hold work the darn okay and I did have to glue some back in place and that's all right I will continue to glue these back in place okay until they fall off like the nail part I will be getting 75 more packs of these okay it's an exaggeration but I need more packs of these nails because they are divine this kind of like I don't even know what to call it I like it's like a glitter, but not a glitter. It is, oh, they're so good. They kind of like are reflective. Like it's almost iridescent. Like it's just so many things to describe this. And I don't even know if any of these words are correctly describing what these nails are doing in person, but they're gorgeous. I can see where it is starting to rub off at the tips. So I need to put a like coat of polish on these for right honey because none of this can rub off so they're gonna have a butterfly rhinestone on them and they're also gonna have like this little rhinestone cluster these things do get caught on everything that's the only thing i don't like about wearing nails with accoutrements like this it's gonna snag it's gonna catch on every little thing honey but they're gorgeous i'm obsessed and this kind of like the color underneath it is kind of like a nudish brownish color which is perfect against this melanated skin honey y'all go get these nails okay if y'all don't get nothing else in this haul if you're a rhinestone girly i understand that not everybody wants a couture mouse on their nails but if you are go ahead and get these 10 out of 10 recommend and the thickness is really nice like these look like they're growing out of my cuticle or i went to the nail salon and got them done these are gorgeous next up this is what i ordered and this is what i got these are the French Ballet False Nail Tips Butterfly Silk Glitter, honey. And they were $4.38. Okay, let's get into it, honey, okay? Now, I don't know who these are from because there's a big old sticker on the front. It just says Press On Nail and then it says Professional underneath that. Now, I don't know if it's the False Nail Professional or what Nail Professional it is, but that's what it says. Now, at first glance, I thought these were giving more than what they're giving okay some of the accent nails are better than others but for the same price as these nails they ain't giving what these nails is giving i'm just gonna tell you that right now let's start with the positive shall we so the color of the nails is gorgeous the pearls are nice this printed nail they did that it's like almost like a swoosh kind of gives like a ribbony effect those are really pretty. The printing on it is not opaque because it shouldn't be. Those are gorgeous. This little clear rose accoutrement, honey, is very nice. The rhinestones are giving what the rhinestones need to give. Now, <laughs> first of all, the glue is sloppy, okay? They put a bunch of glue on this little pearl up here and it's just sitting in a puddle of glue versus on this other nail that looks exactly like this one. It's not. It has like a leaf pattern on here. And inside is this very sporadic glitter, honey. 
this ain't the glitter polish. Like, y'all need to find another glitter polish or whatever. I don't know if y'all spray it. I don't know what y'all do. Y'all need to find a better one than this. Because even the French tip, not giving. Ooh, child. On some of the French tips, they have this, like, pearl that's supposed to go around the French tip. Child, this mess is sloppy. It doesn't go all the way to, like, end to end. And this one is crooked. The glue is very thick, which I guess is nicer. It's not going to come off, but who wants all this glue on your nail? They do have like a little clear butterfly on this nail. Those are cute. Again, it's just this glitter. I don't know what kind of glitter they use, but that's what y'all need to use on these. Okay? Because these ain't it. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the long pointed false nail gradient pink pattern and they were $3.04. These are from False Nail Professional. Oh, they came with glue. Thanks, guys. And they came with nail tabs. I like that for us. These are all right. False Nail Professional and our last little haul with them. Did not do a good job, honey. I do like how long these nails are now. They did a good job on that because y'all know I like me a long nail, honey. Overall, it's an okay set. Like, it's good. Shall we say that? Um, the glitter on it is going to give you this iridescent feel. It's all right. I do wish that they had put maybe a few more coats of that glitter on there, you know, so it was a little less see-through. That's just me. Um, the marble, y'all love to put a little flick of the wrist on this marble, honey, and it's all right. It's giving what most of the marbles on this channel give. You definitely need to put a top coat on these. These nails are sturdy, though. These some thick nails, honey. So that's good, and I love me a good stiletto. So they're all right. Like, they're not the best. They ain't the worst. They are right. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the long pointed false nail and they were $3.04. I was kind of on this like silvery kick this time around. I don't know why, but I was. So we're here. These are pretty. They have like a gradient. These are, are from False Nail Professional. Okay. Okay, guys. And they kind of have like a gradient with like a silver tip to them which is nice. The nails are very pink. The actual nail itself is like a translucent pink nail. Okay. But I don't think they'll be too bad. This is pretty. I like, it's very simple. Okay. Sometimes simple will get you right, honey. The gradient on this is nice. The nail thickness is good. Again, this is going to be like a see-through nail, honey. So you're going to see all them, the glue underneath um, unless you do the gel the gel glue to go under the lamp. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Unless you do that, it'll be better. So, you know, it wasn't much to critique. They all the same and it's just a little gradient. So those is nice. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the Silver Gray Glitter Ballerina Fake Nail Sets, honey. And they were $3.37. It's just like it could go either way with full nail professional. Either it could be good or it could be very mediocre. Okay, it looks much better, like out of the package. This isn't super opaque because I can see through it. I think they try to fake you out by putting it on like the white thing so that you don't see how translucent it is. This marble nail pretty much has a cuticle. It's going to be clear. So you're going to see all that glue. Okay, that tab, whatever, underneath this. The marble is printed on, so it does kind of like fade towards the ends like from end to end on both sides it's all right i wouldn't be mad at these put a top coat on it might look, make them look a little bit better but they definitely look better outside the package than they did inside the package these are some thick nails like i can barely bend the cuticle part okay y'all next up this is what i ordered and this is what i got these are the kawaii Press on Nails Y2K, honey, and they were $4.32. When I tell you I was waiting for these nails at the door, I love them. I don't know where I'm going to wear them. Maybe like New Year's Eve this year. We are very far away from that. But I just loved how they dangled. These are from Beautiful Nails. Comes with tabs, and it's, it's a pretty long nail file for these kind of sets. So, okay, y'all. I'm gonna do something a little different. I see y'all. Oh, and it comes with nail glue. Surprise, surprise. Okay, so not all the nails are gonna have the little dangly dangly bits. I like it, but I don't like it at the same time. I, you know, I just wanted all of them. 
to have the dangly bits. And these are going to have to be like a one-nighter because how in the world am I going to take a shower, go to the bathroom even with these nails? They give you 10 nails with the like rhinestones coming down the middle. The nail is going to be translucent, but they're like a pinkish color clear. And so are the nails that the rhinestones are running down the front of. These don't seem to be going nowhere. The glue is a little messy. This one almost looks like before it set, the rhinestone little chain thing kind of dipped off to the side. But these are cute. Look at the little dangly dangly. I like these a lot. These are a pretty thick nail. I would say they're about medium thickness. The cuticle part is pretty bendable. I love this like how light this pink is. It's a really pretty color in contrast to the rhinestones. It really lets the rhinestones shine. These are a good little special occasion birthday nail, honey, okay? That's the good thing about press-ons. I could have three sets of birthday nails in one weekend, okay? Because we're just going to press it on, go, and then take it off. Switch it up. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the Kawaii Press On Nail Y2K again. And they were $3.92. Okay, false nail professional. I liked these because they had like a big old heart rhinestone on them. I ain't never wore no nails or nothing this big on them before. And I was like, oh, this is cute. But I do love the like regular nails that have the rhinestones on them. With the French tip, I thought those were really cute. These could be a good wedding nail, honey. Maybe I should do like a little wedding nail roundup. These are cute. The French tip of this is not white. It's kind of like a beige or an off-white cream, if you will. And these are really cute. The little rhinestones on here. They do have nails that don't have the rhinestones on it with the French tip. The cuticle part is going to be pretty much transparent so you're going to see glue and everything underneath it just so you know these are a good thickness of nail honey i really really like these the heart ones are cute too a little big for my taste but the heart i like it because it's, it's not like a perfect heart it's a little bit bigger on one end than the other these could go with like an all cream outfit and just like giving false nail professional i told y'all they either do it or they don't honey and they did these next up this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the 24 piece box fake French Y2K nails and they were $3.06. Okay, when I was ordering these, I had like a star kick. These are from Beautiful Nail. Love them. Beautiful Nail, call me, okay? Like, I need y'all to get to my channel some kind of way. I don't know how, but some kind of way. We need to work together. These are gonna be a black French tip with black plain nails and they're gonna have a cream star on them. I really like these. I don't know why. I was just kind of obsessed. I feel like I was in my, you know, Mrs. Captain America age or something. The placement of the stars is nice. The printing is crisp, honey. On the black solid nail that the star is on, I don't see any bleeding or anything like that. I do wish, because on the French tip nails, the beige star kind of goes a little bit above the French tip, which is fine. But it blends in so much with the nail that you can't really see that like little bit of tip. That's my only thing. I wish it was a little bit darker there. The black nails are printed on and some of them, not all of them, the printing doesn't go from end to end. These are a thin nail. These things is getting push to push, honey, okay? But these are cute. I really like these. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These again are the 24 piece fake French Y2K nails and they were $3.06. Again, it was something about the French strips with the stars, honey. These ones I really liked because they reminded me of those chrome uh, nails that people be getting when they got a brush on the chrome. Y'all seen them. Anyways, okay, the printing of this silver is really nice. It's going from end to end, honey. This is pretty and it's giving me chrome. It's giving me silver. I like the red not all the red stars are going to be super opaque. Um, they're a little translucent on some of them and the printing isn't as like vibrant. It is what it is. The star on these ones is not as traditional, shall I say, as the black and cream pair. It's a little bit more of like a wonky star, kind of like one you may have drawn in maybe kindergarten. 
Just saying. But I think it's intentional. These are pretty thin. The tips are pretty sturdy and thick, but the um, probably like just even halfway up the nail, it's very bendable. But these are cute. I really like this silver set. I've been getting in silver nails lately. Clearly, I have ordered a lot of things with silver accents and accoutrements on them. I'm still a gold jewelry girl, but I do love the little silver accents. They just give in what needs to be given, honey, okay? Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the charming, sparkling, purple, long coffin nail and they were $3. So first of all, AliExpress, Amazon, Shein nails. I have never had nails come like this. I'm here for it but I've just never had nails come like this. They're normally in a box. It's all different shapes of boxes, but they're normally in a box. I have never had them come in a bag like somebody hand painted the nails. I will say there is a rhinestone that has already fallen off of these nails. The coloring on this is gorgeous. Let's just take them out, honey. So I am gonna have to glue that back on, but again, for $3, it ain't that big of a deal. Comes with extra nails. It does say 24 pieces. Now, I don't know if this is 24 pieces, but it says it's 24 pieces. This color, though, is gorgeous. It's like an iridescent, like bluish, purplish. It has a little flex of like green. I don't know. It's a thousand one colors in this little thing, and I'm here for it. The glue is a little sloppy. It's not horrible, but it's a little sloppy. Some of these rhinestones are not centered where they should be centered. Again, we're going to pay $3 for them. It is what it is, but this color polish. Hunty, giving, okay? These are gorgeous and they're nice and long. Y'all know I love me a long nail, okay? They're okay thickness. I would say like a medium thickness. These are nice though. This iridescent, honey, I'm about to be out here just doing this all night. Just from different angles, you just see different things. Like it is painted on a black base. So at certain angles, you do see that black kind of come through but I think that's also just part of what the polish is giving it does come with nail tabs and a file maybe there's 24 nails in here I'm not about to count all these nails these are the only ones that have the accent on them is the ones on this card just so you know I am pleasantly surprised by these and again the packaging like did somebody hand paint these nails or do they just make it look like it okay that is it that is my full aliexpress pressed on nail haul you can watch my other nail hauls here but since you've made it this far you might as well join the tribe of baddies on a budget honey and hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you're the first to be notified every time i post a new video and you might as well follow me on ig and tiktok until next time sis watch this video those picks specifically for you